Hey everybody, I'm Steve from Camping with Steve and Cooking with Steve and Boondocking, but uh, I'm trying out a new stove today. This is the Camp Chef uh, Alpine Camp Chef. It's heavy and uh, I've got it for winter camping, so I'm going to be doing a lot of winter camping this year. And I'm going to fit it into the ice fishing shack, but for now, I really have to set this up test it out and bake off the enamel. Last year I had a really shitty one that was the uh, military type with a two inch flue. It was horrendous. So this has been a decoration in my house all year and I hope uh, it works out all right. So we're going to test this out right now. Okay, now this stove heavy as anything. That probably means it'll last a while. Inside of it, you got telescoping lengths of uh, venting for it. Holy moly! Got uh, Spark screen, a couple of side uh, racks for warming stuff up. Then you actually have four legs. And a damper that uh, goes in the flute. So, instruction, okay? Well, I think it's pretty straightforward. So, we're going to see what we can do here and what it's going to look like. But uh, it's very good quality, very heavy gauge steel. I'm very happy with all of this. It's going to be a great, uh, a great addition to winter camping versus last year's stove. So, I'm going to work at this and uh, talk to you in a sec. This is where our damper goes, wherever that went. There we are. Bingo. Hey, I'm just setting up a wood stove. What are you doing? Okay. <laughs> Jeez. No, I'm filming for YouTube right now, so uh, I'll talk to you later. Uh, I'm, I don't know, sticks? <laughs> we'll find out, okay? All right, bye. So anyway, we're going to attach the other segments. There we go. Sparks green, slides on top.
Oh, right. This little guy needs to be burned for a few hours before you actually use it in the real world. So this grate comes with it. Nice ash grate. And These guys are gone to it. Now, I don't remember at all what I paid for this guy, but this is probably going to be the last stove I own. It is uh, kind of a last forever type of deal. But uh, we're going to fire it up and uh, burn all this uh, paint off of it before I use it in the ice fishing shack. All right, we're gonna light this thing up. It needs to burn for a good hour or two to get all this paint off it before you can actually use it. So, time for the first trial run of this guy. So we're getting ready to bake that enamel off. And uh, I got good hopes for this stove. I've seen a bunch of good reviews on it. And uh, it'd be nice to get this baked off and actually cook something on it tonight. So we'll see what happens. Right, this little stove here is going to be going in the ice fishing shack. The last one we had had a two inch flue instead of this big five to six inch one. And it smoked us out. We had no air to breathe. It was, uh, you had to have it roaring with the door open to not get the smoke inside. But I see no smoke coming out here. It's perfect draft going right up it. This is a true wood stove. So we're starting to get the enamel baking off at the top. So I am going to close this. All right, from what I've seen this stove so far, it is performing flawlessly. We have no smoke coming out here. There's wonderful draft with the door closed even, just shooting out the uh, chimney. So we are gonna set this up tomorrow in the uh, ice fishing shack.
and get that all ready to go for the winter because this thing is going to make winter camping completely possible. I can feel the heat coming off from here. This is going to be a very, very solid uh, heater. All right, now this is getting highly dark. So most of this enamel has burned off and we are going to get some sausages on the go for tonight with the secret ingredient of beer. So this should cook up quick and we're going to have a final review on this apparatus. We've got no smoke escaping along the whole seam of this oven. This is a fantastic piece of machinery. Alright, the sun is setting quickly, but things are cooking beautifully on this stove. No smoke whatsoever from the front, all going up. Actually, not a lot of smoke either. This is a beautiful setup. I would say grab this if you can. It'll be the only stove you're probably going to use in your life. Uh, sorry for going so late with the video. It got a little dark, but. Uh, September and we're getting this thing ready for all winter camping so this will be going into the ice fishing shack next week and then you're gonna see uh, a whole bunch more winter camping videos featuring this guy thanks for watching